being at that clinic in Orlando and with a suspected brain tumor must be quite a, it must have taken a toll on you, must have thought, <laughs> especially on that bed when you must be there going undergoing the treatment. How was it like? You know, to start off with, it actually taught me not to believe everything you hear because the first diagnosis was wrong. At that time, I didn't understand what it was all about in the beginning. The first, I think, 48 hours, I, I had no idea what it was. And uh, when you get, uh, you know, kind of told that you got, you know, a few months to live and you're never going to walk again and blah, 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 and things like that, it makes you sit back. Because as an athlete, you're strong. As an athlete, you're powerful. As a, a spiritual person, you believe in in uh, longevity of life. You believe in, in um, you know, you know that... I believe at that time that as an athlete I was just so powerful that how could I get this? Mm -hmm. I, I really believe that I'm on my second innings. I believe that I'm leading a second a, a second opportunity. And and actually there are quite a few different sides to me. There, there's one side who was before, you know, um, yeah. the experience that I went through with my tumor. Or uh, There's a, a huge side for me after. I, mean, I, I had to first learn how to shed the 100 pounds that I put on because of the medication. I had to really fight hard to to figure out what did I want to do. Mm. I did not want to come back and play tennis really at that moment in time. Um, there were some days that, I, that were tough. There were some days that were doubtful. But I think there's, a, there's an inner belief in me at that time that I knew I was going to be fine. Mm -hmm. And in that belief, I basically was searching for what am I going to do next. Okay. And uh, really, I guess, like, you know, you take yourself with a pinch of salt. You... Now I, I've made a, a, a vow to myself to live in the moment. Mm -hmm. Not live in the past, not live in the future. Yes, plan for the future, learn from the past, but really live each moment for what it is. Did you break down emotionally at that point of time? Ki how, where, will I get down from this bed or not? No, I think it was just something that made me really strong. And I think that I'm not the only person, but I think that there are so many beautiful stories all around the world that I used at that time. Mm -hmm. As motivation to me. So, us mag be up spiritually very strong the because koi bhi ek vyakti hota, koi bhi hota, wo ghabra jata us ghar usko pata chalta ki mujhe tumor hai, main shayad zada din zinda nahi reh sakta hu, aur wo bhi somebody like you, jisko bhi zindagi mein bahut kuch karna tha. Inshallah, our support system kafi tez hai. Mummy, daddy the, dono bhen the, itne jo friends, uh, friendships jo main. Uh, uh, इतने फ्रेंडशिप में जो मैं बॉन्ड uh, मिले पूरे जिंदगी सब फ्रेंड्स आए थे दैट सपोर्ट सिस्टम इज इज व्हाट वी रियली रियली नीड एज ह्यूमन बीइंग्स एंड दैट आई थिंक दैट स्पिरिचुअलिटी दैट आई हैव गॉट वाज एनहांस्ड एट द टाइम व्हेन आई व्हेन आई नीडेड नीडेड इट द मोस्ट आई रियलाइज्ड वेरी अर्ली इनटू माय डायग्नोसिस दैट दिस वाज अ चैलेंज फॉर मी हाउ वाज आई गोइंग टू गेट आउट ऑफ इट इट वाज जस्ट लाइक अनदर टेनिस मैच दैट आई गॉट एन ओपोनेंट आई गॉट एन ऑब्स्टिकल नाउ गेट आउट यू नो फाइंड अ वे Kind of and I think that's what life's about. It's not about, you know, butting heads against it. It's not about getting frustrated. It's not about calming down to it. No. Mm -hmm. But I've then always you must basically have put on that much of weight mm -hmm. and, you know, the post, post the medication. I mean, it must be tough to come back mm -hmm. again to the tennis court mm -hmm. and pick up the racket and say, oh, with so much of weight around, how am I going to At play? that time it was tough. I felt like Humpty Dumpty. Yes. I mean, running on the tennis court is a bit of a problem, but... I think it's again, uh, it's, uh, it's a belief. I am a Hindustani. I believe in belief. And the people who are with us are with us, and are with us, and are with us, and support us, and for them, I am back to tennis. Leander, what went wrong with Mahesh and you? We have a lot of respect for each other. Mm -hmm. And I think that that's the beautiful aspect of it. But also I believe that uh, both Hesh and myself were responsible for the breakdown of the whole thing. I think that we could have handled it differently. Yes, we were younger at that time, so we both had our own egos. Yes, we were younger at that time, so we, we didn't have as much experience as we have now um, to really kind of sit and communicate. But you are completely mentally different. You came different. together again, but again you've gone back. I mean, you play sometimes for the country together. But mm -hmm. that kind of a rapport, which was in the first time in Mahesh Bhupati, 
वो अब दिखता नहीं है यू नो इट्स वन फेर कॉन्वर्सेशन टू डे सो इट्स नॉट रियली फेयर ऑल्सो टू माई फॉर मी टू टॉक यू एंड एंड इफ आई इफ आई रियली थिंक अबाउट इट आई रादर लीव दैट मेमोरी इन माई हेड ऑफ माई एंड ऑफ वॉट वी हैड टूगेदर ऑफ रिस्पेक्ट हैव द रिस्पेक्ट इन्जॉय वॉट वी डन इन द पास्ट हु नोज वॉट टूमारो ब्रिंग्स कीप एन ओपन माइंड एंड एट द सेम टाइम यू नो आई नो दैट इन द करंट एटमोस्फियर दैट आई गॉट अ ग्रेट पार्टनर आई नो ही इज गॉट अ ग्रेट पार्टनर सो वी हैव डिफरेंट लाइफ वी स्टैंड फॉर वेरी डिफरेंट की प्रोफेशनल से ज्यादा कहीं ना कहीं पर्सनल हो गया था शायद अगर आप लोग उसको पर्सनल चीजों को नहीं लाते बीच में तो ये रिलेशनशिप और अच्छा होता मगर हमारा प्रोफेशन भी पर्सनली है तो एंड एंड वेन स्पेशली वेन यू कम फ्रॉम द सेम कंट्री यू नो देर इज लॉट ऑफ राइवलरी देर इन डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स एंड हो गए एट दैट यंग एज यू नो राइवलरी आप लोग दोनों में थी और आई थिंक एवरी एथलीट हैज दैट सेंस ऑफ प्राइड इन दैम स्पेशली एवरी टॉप एथलीट दैट प्राइड इज वॉट गिवस यू दैट Jigger to really go out on the on the court and be the best you can be. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, when you're doing things as a team, the team is the most important. It doesn't yes. matter whether it's Mahesh's way, it doesn't matter whether it's Leander's way. The team is what's the most important, and that is what I feel sad for both of our responsibility for letting that fall. Mm-hmm. Okay. And but is there any one responsible thing? Both of us, don't know. Don't know. Of course, mm-hmm. it always is two-sided. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm sure I can sit here and nitpick what he did wrong, and he can nitpick what I did wrong. But at the end of the day, it was both of us. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We were responsible. We were grown men. We uh, were professionals, and uh, and we did some beautiful things together. We had a great run. I mean, so in one year, four Grand Slam finals, yeah, exactly. two Grand Slams. We won. I just won my my third French Open doubles yeah, title exactly. uh, a fortnight ago, and serving for the match. I still remember when I when we played the uh, won the first uh, uh, French Open title. we played against goran ivanisevich and jeff tarango okay and uh, the same sort of combat you know this time i was playing against two boys who were really tall mm-hmm. one was uh, 1.8 meters tall the other was 2.3 meters tall i mean huge fellows and they had as powerful serves as goran ivanisevich mm-hmm. did so it somewhat you know kind of reminded you of brought back the old memory of of what we did and in in our second french open that we played uh, our opponents Pavel Wisner and Peter Pala from the Czech Republic yeah. were serving for the first set at 5-3 and I believe they were 40-15 up if my memory serves me right and we came back this year as well our opponents were serving for the first set at 5-3 but we had a break point so you and at that moment you remember when I had that, that break point I said I remember that moment you know the second uh, French Open that I had won that I had come back from there Hmm. But when I lost the first set this time, I said, "Yeah, yeah, to go back or not? You know that we've lost the first." To watch more, log on to www. news24online. com.